it's Thursday, July 28th, 2011. <sighs> Thank God tomorrow's Friday. We're almost done the week. Back on night shifts. And welcome to my vlog. That sucks. I think the raccoons decided to beat the shit out of the neighbor's garbage can yesterday and just friggin' threw garbage all over their front yard. Uh, I tried that with mine, but didn't seem to get too far with it. Yay! Yeah, I gotta put my garbage out too. Friggin' yesterday I left my car doors unlocked. I thought uh, Sony was breaking into my car. I was actually hearing friggin' raccoons attacking the garbage cans. They knocked theirs over and... The neighbor across the street's over. You can see that, uh, uh, you probably can't see it, I don't know, but his one lid's all messed up. They knocked his garbage cans over, and they never even bothered coming up here and grab mine. Probably because there's nothing in there that's really letting off any odor, except for just garbage juice, but whatever. That reminds me, I gotta get my garden hose working one of these days and clean that garbage can out. Uh, I hope today's an easy day at work. Usually when you get close to a long weekend, it gets pretty easy. Um, people tend to travel take a couple days off from work because you're already off Monday, the following Monday. So some people take two floaters or, you know, two personal days and take Thursday and Friday off and they, they, they take off traveling and go visit family or whatever. So maybe uh, we'll luck out and there'll be a lot of people on vacay and uh, it'll be a pretty dead Thursday and Friday. You never know. Here's hoping. Here's hoping. It'd be nice. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna head inside and get something to eat and then uh, head her off to work. So I'll talk to you guys in a bit. Oh, yeah. Gotta get gas one of these days. All right, well, I'm gonna head her into work. Oh my god. All right. Let's uh, freaking go into work and uh, go from there. So I'm gonna drive in right now and uh, I'll talk to you guys once I get there. Scrap metal corner? I do believe so. Another fun day trying to get to work. Well, all the construction happening over here. Holy shit. Freaking guys are pounding the ground, chopping out the pavement, and blocking off the roads. And man, it's gonna be loud in that building today, let me tell you. I am not looking forward to this. Hey. Oh well. Well, we're at work now, so let's just uh, freaking pitter patter and get out of here. It looks like it's gonna rain today, so that sucks. Hopefully, it doesn't rain all weekend for the Heritage Festival. Oh, look at that guy. He's like way the hell up on the hill. He's like king on the hill. Freaking crazy bastard. But, uh, yeah. I'm gonna head her inside and uh, make a couple cups of coffee and I'll talk to you guys at break if it's not raining. Ice. Well, it's currently break time. You probably can't hear too much of me, but with these guys working out here, like you hear that? Got a lot of moat digging going on, boys. Lots of moat digging. I think Pug Woman would be proud of this moat. Completely segregated off the road. It's crazy. Alrighty, well, it's lunchtime. So I just went and got some food. Got myself a fajita wrap and something to drink. Oh boy, it's a hot and muggy one today, but it's starting to look a little clearer up there, so that's sweet. They're still digging moats behind me here, behind the building. Loud as hell inside. Yeah, good times, good times. So on the weekend, I was talking to the girlfriend. We're gonna go to uh, the Telus Mobility Store and uh, take a look at their new phone. Apparently they're getting a new HTC phone. Uh, in the UK it's called the Cha Cha. In North America it's called Status. And I'm gonna take a look at it. It kind of looks like a Blackberry with Android, so that should be fun. I don't know, I've been looking up reviews on it. It looks pretty decent. I guess uh, the only way, only thing to do now is actually hold it and play with it. That sounded dirty, I apologize. So I'm gonna head her inside, eat, and then I'll uh, talk to you guys in a bit. Oh, diggers everywhere. Insane. Alright, it's four o'clock. Time to pit her patter and get at her and get her home. Oh, one more day and we're done. That freaking construction's pissing me off. It vibrates the whole freaking building on the inside. It's brutal. Let's head her home. Alright, we're home now. And uh, I think Oreo just got himself a carrot. <laughs> Girlfriend must have dropped the baby carrot on the ground because he totally just scooped it up. Hey dude, what do you got in your mouth? Yeah, he got a carrot in his mouth. Go ahead. Crazy puppy. He's really got to pee. See, look, you can tell. Leg lift. Yeah. Doesn't do that too often, but you can see the carrot in the corner of his face. 
So you probably sit down and eat that, but we're home. Holy crap, bud, you've been holding in for a while. Got some awesome news today, awesome news. I'll uh, show you this, it's friggin' amazing. I didn't think it would actually work, but sure enough it did. Check this out. Um, basically, action taken, and they've reviewed my impersonation claim and taken appropriate action. So, looks like I got that channel taken down. Awesome. Of course, it doesn't stop them from making another one, right? But, they'll just keep building them, and I'll just keep knocking them down now that I know how to do it. So, I'd just like to know why. Why are they attacking me, you know? What the hell did I ever do to them? You know, you got like uh, three guys on there that are friggin' harassing me. And I honestly have no idea what I've done to them. But, uh, somebody commented that uh, they're the same people who are attacking Pug and I'm guessing I'm just collateral damage because I'm Pug's friend. So, you know, that's what they do. They don't like the fact that you're friends with somebody, and rather than, you know, them just being like, I don't like that you're friends with him, but whatever, no. They gotta harass you because they're terrorists. They're no different than Al-Qaeda. They're terrorists, you know? They don't like the way you are. They don't like the fact that you hang out with somebody. They don't like the fact that you like somebody's videos, whatever. So they terrorize you. How's that different than a terrorist, than a real terrorist, right? It's not. Same freaking thing. But, uh, anywho, uh, I'm home now, so I'm gonna head her inside and friggin', uh, I think it's gonna piss tonight because it's disgusting out. And it is muggier than all hell right now. And Oreo's back in the raspberry bush <laughs> eating friggin' berries. <laughs> oh, my dog's a vegetarian sometimes. He loves raspberries. And it's perfect because they're right there for him. Like, I don't know if you can see him picking the berries, but he's totally pulling them off the branch and eating them. He just loves berries, I guess. But yeah, anywho, I'm gonna head her inside, so I'll talk to you guys in a bit, and yeah. Alrighty, so we came out for supper. We got a $10 gift certificate in the mail for these guys. So we're gonna come and eat $10 with appetizers. It's gonna be awesome. So, uh, we'll talk to you guys on the inside. Dinner is served. Jerk chicken sandwich, fries, girlfriends have fish and potatoes. Now we're down here at Canadian Tire. I'm gonna get my light bulb because my car sounds like a piece of crap. With the tick 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 checking out barbecues and yeah, they're expensive. Like they got this one here, it's just a grill top. It went 250 bucks. That's sale. The Master Chef. Yeah, that looks really crappy compared to the one I Oh, this is super crappy. For the same price. Yeah, super crappy. Oh, look at this. Look at this little guy. You could do like a steak and a half on it. Perfect. Oh, perfect. Oh, this little round guy. Perfect. 16 inch electric. <laughs> I can grill in my garage. Nice. A portable Coleman. Friggin' hell. We're getting better. Oh, 239 for the Master Chef. I don't know if that brand's any good. This looks all right. How much is that one? 189. Oh, perfect. Got the big. I'm with forty dollars off because of my little mini tire car. That's one forty-nine. That'd be good. I still like that one at Walmart better though. I like it because it's red. And I had the. But I like side that. Grill. You don't need a side grill. No, but. Like you don't. You don't use that. Like this one here is two forty-nine, and it's got the side grill, but you never use this. This is pointless. Corn. You can whatever. And this one's it's got a lamp. Oh, it's got a lamp for for the daytime sun. Perfect. That's a thousand dollars for right here. Holy crap! This thing does have a roti oh, it's got a rotisserie. That's why. Oh, well, that's yeah. Cool. So you can like do a full chicken on it. That's kind of neat. Look, is it natural gas? The thing. Natural gas. These are probably all natural gas, aren't they? Oh, that's the thing. Well, now we know barbecues at uh, Canadian Tire are friggin' expensive. Jesus. Oh, we'll keep browsing around. Smell as bad of gasoline in here now. It still stinks, but not as bad as it did before. Holy shit! That was nasty before, guys. Literally smelled like somebody spilled a full jerry can of gas in here. Well, somebody sort of did. That's a bonus. It's about 8:30 at night now. I honestly don't think anything else is going on tonight. So, I'm gonna shut the vlog down here. Adrian's working, so he's out for coffee. I can't get a hold of Cat Piss. 
thinking I might just call it an early night, get a lot of sleep, and maybe tomorrow night do something, I don't know. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to end the vlog here, so if you like today's video, you know what to do. Go ahead and hit the like button, that lets me know you like the video, and I like that. And if you really like the video, go ahead and favorite it or share it to Facebook for your friends to see. You know, whatever. And uh, any questions, comments, concerns, you know what to do. Leave them in the comment section below and I'll be sure to answer them. And until next time, guys, keep on vlogging.